The wait is over, everyone. I am back from Greece. Tom is here, and we are once again in the world of Dead Island Riptide. Oh, yes. I am also going to be doing my perspective on my personal channel. So if you guys want to tune into that, I'll put an, I'll have Dewey put an annotation into it. And you can see both of our perspectives. And I'm going to start my video for this part in 3, 2, 1. So if you open that up and link that up with the time, you can watch it in dual screen action. Just mute one of them. It'll be awesome. Oh, Dewey's inside of me right now. <laughs> so yeah, if you guys have dual monitors, or if you don't, you can just set them up side by side, and you can see both perspectives and see Yay. who's doing what. <clears throat> now, Tom, I didn't completely forgot where we are. All right, Harlow. Oh, the not really outpost. Outpost. Yep. <laughs> All right, find a way in. Oh, great! Another rundown shithole. All also, right. to those of get... you only watching on the media cows, uh, this character is Logan. Hi, hi, guys. I uh, I throw things. And, oh, um, you're a thrower. Yeah, I'm a thrower. And I well, made this character so that we can resume the the walkthrough. Let's see if this intercom works. And Dewey's gonna uh. be a boss because he's super high level. <laughs> Yo, Doctor Kessler. Doctor Kessler. Open up. Who is it? What do you want? My name is Sam B, and I really need your help. Please let me in. I am busy doing serious research here. I have no time for visitors. Leave me be. Mm-hmm, that's what I want to talk mm -hmm. to you about. Your, your study on Kuru disease. That shit was genius, man. Uh, but I had a couple questions for you. I swear I can't get a moment's peace around here. Very well, come in. Oh, man. So, so while I was in Greece, I, uh, I got to hang out with, uh, with one of my friends, Kabi. And Kabi has let's given me full permission to be as racist as I want towards him. Now, I won't do that, uh, but let's just say that Kabi carries some stereotypes that, uh, that may may include, you know, some black stereotypes. But uh, I have I, I haven't heard the word bitches so many times in a week than I have in my entire life. Like that last week. Oh my <laughs> god, it was wonderful and painful at the same time. I mean, all credit to Kabi. There's no man on this planet that is more positive than him. But he calls things bitches a lot. Yes, in a good way. Tom, we got some strange. Mutated thing here. Pustule carrying bitches. <laughs> oh boy. What the fuck are hey, those come things? Come on, Kessler. What is it? Explain. I, I need to get to Henderson, and I heard you know a way through those old Japanese tunnels. There aren't any tunnels. Now get out of here. I am a scientist, not a tour guide. Stop wasting my time. Marcus Villa told me about them tunnels, so I know you know about them. You saw Marcus. I haven't seen him in ages. He was brilliant, you know, in his odd way. But let us just say there are reasons we no longer work together. Very good reasons. Yeah, he tried to eat me. I get it. He's fucked up crazy. He wanted to eat you. That doesn't make any sense. Sure, he went to live with the natives, but they've always struck me as peaceful people. Perhaps he was worse off than I even imagined. But that does not explain why he would resort to cannibalism. He said he needed flesh from somebody who's immune. Said he wanted to make a cure or some shit. Wait a moment, are you saying that you are immune to what's happening out there? And then, this certainly changes I'm things, doesn't it? I'm trying to kill Kessler. Yes, I'm afraid it does. Yeah, I have a map that you should find helpful. But if you want it, you need to help me with something. I have been researching this disease for many years now. Kuru has been endemic to the indigenous people here for centuries. This outbreak is one of many, and each incident is a little different, as is the trigger that reawakens the plague. It's truly remarkable how this prion disease adapts on changes, how it mutates when exposed to external factors, the speed at which it affects the host organism. Astonishing, really. But science can be unpredictable. Dangerous, even. You understand? Yeah. You understand? Mm -hmm. Yeah. I'm guessing them corpses out in the greenhouse unpredicted themselves to an early grave. <laughs> a truly unfortunate accident. One that was largely the fault of my assistance. I assure you, I had very little to do with what happened out there. Whatever, man. Just tell me what you want me to do so I can get the hell out of here. I am merely trying to make it clear that I am not an evil man. In 
times such as these, it is easy for men of science to be blamed, persecuted for their actions, especially by people who possess lesser minds. My four it's assistants were in possession of <laughs> some reagents, chemicals contained within vials. Unfortunately, those vials are out there in the greenhouse. Bring them to me, and I will give you the map. Do we have a deal? No, fuck you. <laughs> I trust him implicitly. I'ma try. You will probably need to kill all four of them in order to secure the vials. But there is no saving them now. You will be putting them out of their misery. Yeah, man, shit happens. I get it. But you better have that map waiting for me. I cannot conduct my tests without the reagents. This quest will not be written on my profile. So, Do we, for those of uh, you who don't know, huh? Oh, there's a uh, audio diary over here. You want to pick I it think up? I, Although, <laughs> maybe don't pick it up and explain instead what happened with your save. Um, so, this actually has to do with my save. Uh, we already beat the game once, Do so things like those audio diaries are actually not going to be there for me. Oh. Shit, what a mess. So, yeah, apologize for that, but, you know. Eh, there's not much we can do about it. If you want to see more dead I Oh, well, I found that. Apparently, didn't mean... You get to see all the stuff that I completely just missed before. Yeah. So now, he's pretty brave to be staying in this place alone. Like, there's no one else. Oh, nice little shower here. Yay. Get clean. Get um, so but fresh. there's, like, no one else in the vicinity whatsoever. Just these, you know, possible zombies. I don't, I don't know. That's pretty brave. That's... IMO. Yeah, I mean, he's got his lab, it's locked down. Oh, shit, what is... Something's throwing shit at us. Hey, fuck hey, you, hey, man. Hey, bad zombie. He's Did out I of my throwing range, looks like, so... Oh, my God, these guys are all infected and everything. It's gross. Back the fuck off. So, your guy specializes in throwing things? That seems like a kind of lame specializa specialization, Tom. I'm sorry. No, your specialization's lame, Dewey. <laughs> No, you can get throwing knives. Mostly my rage is amazing. When I pop my rage, I mean, I don't know, because everything's probably going to be up-leveled in order to deal with yo badass bow self. Um, but when I pop my rage, everything dies in one shot, and I can throw knives at four things at once. Nice. Like, thugs just die immediately. Um, well, I'll we'll have you deal with the thugs, then. Yeah, and I've only leveled my rage. That's all that I've done. This <laughs> oh, man. No. It's alright, I'm just taking care of things. Control. It just like keeps pushing me off the side of this ladder for no reason. You do have to recover your um Your throwing weapons, yeah, yeah. yeah. So around here this is like a noob trap galore for uh for Logan. <laughs> well, you yeah, luckily you are not a noob, so Yeah, alright. Oh, oh thank you, Logan. You told me to look out. You're such a kind human being. I got your back. Got your back, so, dude. So you just want, like, throwing knives and that kind of stuff? Yeah, pretty much. I mean, I'm always looking for a good knife. Uh, you won't be able to give me any weapons that you get, though. They'll be too high level. Oh, yeah, that's right. Well, then. The reagent oh, we got a reagent. We got to kill some more of those guys. So I'm basically just going to be bonus damage from a distance, throwing some shit at people. I mean, I guess if you have to deal with people being high level, that's, you know, a good way to deal with it. That was part of the thought process, yeah. I'm just like, well, I can do this, and then I won't just be dying constantly. <laughs> or you could have just been Sam B, and then there could have been two Sam Bs. Oh, shit. Oh, yeah, that's right, this door thing. Uh, you can go first. <laughs> okay. Yeah, I get, I think, 15% of my rage every time I kill someone with a one-handed weapon, and throwing what? knives count as one-handed weapons, so yeah, my, my rage fills up rather quickly. Oh. I do think oh, I have to get a killing lighting. blow, though, so that's, like, not gonna happen very often. <laughs> <laughs> well, what's he doing? He's trying to get up. Let's not let him get up. Oh, God. Oh my goodness. <laughs> doing the, the electric slide. Oh, oh. He's, he's taking care of himself. Very slowly. I like seeing him electrocuted. Got him. Electrocuted. The reagent is mine. Getting all the re reagents. I am. 
Well, I'm the chemist, Dewey. Oh, uh, that's true. What are you gonna do with reagents? I don't do anything with reagents. I don't even know what reagents are. Oh, wow. Oh, no, Dewey's down. I'm popping rage, Dewey. I got your back, son. What can tell me? Ah, nope. Couldn't lift you up. I leveled no, up. I got them all. Nice. Congratulations. I used a katana. That's that was my down do or my undoing there. Uh, I shouldn't have been using katanas. That is not Sam B's weapon of choice by any means. What's this? What's over here? Oh, there's a zombie over here. Definitely accidentally throwing some knives off the edge of this, I guess. I hate the hammer. It's so clumsy. Yeah. Oh, oh. Can't see what I'm doing half the time. Lemon juice. Hmm. We all know that juice packs are the key to survival. Clearly. They're also the key to Buster's heart. Which, for those, if you if you get that reference, applaud to you. If you don't, go watch Arrested Development. It's, it's quite a good, good show. Now we're. Tell me, we gotta we gotta take another shower, buddy. Oh. Gotta uninfect ourselves. Oh, I didn't mean to do that. <laughs> We gotta give Kessler a report. Yo, Here Dr. Go, Kessler. Good, good. Now I can conduct my tests. I only require a sample mm. of your blood. No, that wasn't part mm. of the deal, Doc. Now you hand over that motherfucking map. I am doing a poor job of explaining myself. You are clearly immune, that much is certain. But that does not mean that you are safe. There is a strong possibility that the virus is in your body. And if it is, it could mutate. And depending on how it mutates, you could be in grave danger. All I need is a small blood sample. I run a simple test, and then we'll know. This is for your own good. Let's get this over with. Just clanking some glasses over here. Okay. Don't you will feel a little prick. Nothing to worry. Uh, he wants our blood. I don't really want to give him our blood. I mean, Do I think he's a vampire. And the map is, yours. is that he kind of like does have that vampire feel to him? See I put some blood on the scale. So bad, was it? <laughs> if I had a little okay. sweet, I would give you. He's one. weighing my blood as we speak. When this is all over, you need to have your head examined. How much does your blood weigh? I was merely trying to lighten the mood. Oh, it will only take a moment to prepare the sample. Please be patient. It's not displaying a value. I can't tell you. <laughs> My That's blood weighs green. The screen is green. That's all. <laughs> That's uh, pretty... What, well, it's... This is truly astonishing. Yeah, it weighs green. I was astonished as well. I didn't think that, that was a weight that something could have. I've got your results. Ooh. You are completely resistant to the virus. Tell me something I didn't know. No, it is not what you think. Your resistance to the virus has kept it from multiplying, from wreaking havoc on your body. But it has not destroyed the virus. It has merely suppressed it. You need to be very careful. Any contact with certain types of reagents could trigger a mutation. And if the virus mutates, it stands to reason that you could lose your immunity. Or much, much, much worse. Unfortunately, there are so many factors to consider that it is impossible for me to tell you exactly Need what to I some ammo. Fast. But one thing is clear. You should avoid anything that would put you at risk. What do you mean? Your plan was to use the tunnels to reach Henderson, correct? Yes, the Japanese created them during World War II, and later they were used to store chemical weapons. In the 50s, during a monsoon, there was a leak. On some of those chemicals. Iris mutated and all hell broke loose. The horses had to blow the entrances to prevent the infection from spreading. Most of the men were still down in the tunnels. I have long suspected that exposure to those chemicals is what caused the infected soldier to mutate. Anyway, you need to find the old Jesuit mission. A passageway runs from the ruins down into the tunnels. Here is the map, as I promised. I cannot stop you from going down there. That is your decision. But if you do, use an abundance of Sam is a close talker. Try to avoid prolonged exposure to the chemicals. I wish you best of luck. Thanks. Oh, what are you doing <laughs> up there? 
Harlow, answer the radio. Thank God I was starting to worry. Did you get the map from Kessler? Yeah, I got it. Gonna be a pain going through the tunnels, though. You can fill me in when we meet up. Where are you going now? To find the entrance to the tunnels. Feeling strong. He's got a thing. A taser. I already spent my level up. Oh, you're special. So, just to establish that I do in fact read comments pretty much everywhere. If you go to the team menu, Dewey, you can you can acquire quests from everyone from there. You don't actually have to walk to the town ever to get a quest. Wait, what? Like, if it, on the team menu, oh. right now it's probably empty for you, but like, for me it says, Jian, new quest available, and you can just click her and like, get the quest. Oh. And like, see what the rewards are. I'm not actually gonna pick up extra quests. Oops. Cause, uh, <laughs> yeah. Okay, well, I'll, I'll follow you. I'm kind of impressed. Wait, there's a golf club. You don't want this weak golf club? No, I do not want that weak golf club. What, you got like some super sweet end game weapons or something? <laughs> you fancy pants that? on your high horse. I guess I can level up my lock picking now. I probably should have done that right away. Because <laughs> you kind of were the person who did that before. That's true. I ain't got shit for lock picking now. Back out of the biosphere laboratory. I don't know if that guy talks with a like real German accent or if that's just a Hollywood German accent that no one actually uses in real life. Speaking from someone that's been to Germany, uh, yeah, I don't really <clears throat> remember ever hearing something like that over there. Yeah, and I'm, I'm sure that you ran into people that spoke English fairly regularly, right? Yeah, definitely. It was actually it's generally either they spoke with a different accent or they were English. Maybe you should back the fuck off. Where the, Where the hell did my knife go? Oh, there it is. Yay, my knife. The throwing knives are valuable to me because they stack, so you can oh. equip like a stack of ten of them. Can you use a melee range? Yeah, I mean, it's a little bit cumbersome because you can't throw as quickly as you can swing, you know? Where am I oh. going? I have no idea. I think I can only go to the right, and that also seems to be where the flag is. So let's, uh, let's head that way. Alright, let's head. Oh, that's, that's a suicider. Uh, yeah, no worries. Go. Oh, I can't oh, see shit. I'm just gonna crash into everything here real quick, and there we go. Now we can see <laughs> something. Me zombies. Nice. No, don't mind us, zombies. Uh. We're fine. Uh, that's there we go. For those of you who experience a momentary lapse in audio sound, there, don't worry, it is back. Yeah, hey, oh, oh shit, that's oh, just, uh, 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 just uh. doing it real quick. This is this is how you take a right turn in Palinoy. <laughs> it's just oh god. All right, can we? This I, tree's in the way. Uh, we got. Th there we go. There we go. <laughs> Pedal to the metal, folks. That's what you do. We're good. Uh. Oh, and I like turned around cool. accidentally. There's a cave that, uh, there. that little gap there. You know what, we're just going into this cave real quick to kill these zombies. Okay. Gonna use oh, it to make yeah. a three-point turn. <laughs> Alright, there we go. So, folks, take notes. If you're trying to pass your driver's test, you know... Just keep driving. Make... If Just yeah. pedal gas all the way down all the time. Um, <laughs> and if the instructor tells you that you've done it wrong or tries to tell you that you've, quote, failed, unquote... Just call them a pussy. Tell them you were just looking out for the zombies, you thought there was a zombie down there, and you need to hit the zombie. Yeah. That's Tell them the that obvious. you didn't realize that they weren't metal enough for how you drive. <laughs> and look That's at them in a very condescending way. That zombie behind us was really angry do, at us. Can time. we uh, actually walk there from here? Do we have to walk there from here? I think we do, yeah. We're getting okay. out here. Hey, hey. Hey, zombie oh. friend. <laughs> Here, he was not happy. You ran over his brother. I am dealing marginal <laughs> damage at best. Oh, I just got a slow-mo shot because I threw a throwing knife into his junk while he was at the gr on the ground. <laughs> at least I'm pretty sure that's what happened. So I will point still out, Alright, so you know how sometimes... Alright, this zombie actually moves. But you know how sometimes there's zombies on the ground that are just painted on the ground? Yeah, yeah, Like, yeah. they don't have items, they don't move when you kick them. Those people uh -huh. are actually... Like, just human beings that died. That's, that's oh. what someone pointed out. Yeah, they're not actually zombies. I think we don't want to climb this, right? Right, there we go. Um, Dude's trying to trade with me. Lead. Yeah, well, you know, <laughs> I can't resist trading. 
It's my number one skill. No, Bless me. you. This is actually the yeah. right way to go. Yeah, we want to veer off to the left here, I guess. This Good is either going to be a dead end cave where we just kill people, or it'll be the right right way to go. I feel yeah. like it's the right way to go. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, jeez. Oh, hi, friends. Watch it. Oh, Oh, the humanity! Oh. Yeah, thug. What thug? What thug? What? Ugh, slow mo. Like a bouse. I'll yeah, punch so this torch. <laughs> like a bouse. Another thing with uh, Logan, or like even you know anyone, if you're using throwing weapons, is that there's a little bit of a trade-off. Like the throwing knives stack, and it's great because you can throw a lot of them really quickly without having to what change weapons. Here. Also, mm -hmm. when you pick them up, there's no animation, so you can like get if you're fighting a thug, say, you can throw like eight throwing knives into the front of him, and then just walk up and pick all of them up off of him really, really fast without getting frozen. Hmm. If you throw like a normal one-handed weapon, though, when you pick it up, there's an animation. And, like, after you throw it, you've got to change weapons to the next weapon. So everything's a little bit more clumsy when you're not using the throwing knives, but everything does more damage when you're throwing real weapons. Damn. Even I'm impressed. You see the entrance? Don't sweat me. I'll find it. Oh, yeah, we got to clear this out. All right, Dewey, Dewey, I got this. All right, just, just hold on a second. Just stand back. Just gonna activate my fury up here. All right, all of them are dead. Oh, Jesus Christ. All right, there's a there's a floater over here. He's dead now. Uh, oh there's a God. lot of friends upstairs though. That's the end of my fury though. That fury does not last very long, but oh my shit. God! I just got one shotted by a throwing knife zombie. What a son of a bitch! He must have activated his fury. Yeah, that's probably. What oh. oh, oh, too late. Yeah, you go out. I don't want you in my house. Stay out of my house. Hey, hold on, I'm I'm stamina. Let me. Oh, let me catch my breath. Okay, there we go. Now I'll punch your face in. Oh, oh, jeez. All right, they're, they're flanking me. Get tased. Oh, wait, that's actually an I am Sauron. I ah! want to weapons. Why can't I? What the hell is happening? Oh God, there's a quick death, Dewey. I found a quick death. Um, I can't oh, change oh, weapons right now. I think I need to like unequip this nail gun, or maybe this nail gun became equipped even though it was not equipped. Uh, uh, Where is he going? Oh, I know what happened. Oh, that's like a reproducible glitch. Oh shit, did you die? No, no, over here. no. Right, I'm I'm just trying you. to figure out where he went. I was gonna throw this propane tank at him, but. I have no idea. Oh, there he is. Yeah, all right, so I just oh, discovered a glitch. Um, if you don't have a, like, gun weapon equipped and you throw a propane tank at someone, it will equip one from your inventory that you didn't have equipped before. Yeah. It's kind of nice, right? Um, except for then you can't unequip it. Like, your your ability to unequip weapons. Ah, to change weapons that are equipped. Oh, you just use your scroll wheel. Press You press the scroll wheel. Oh, and then it brings up the... Oh, okay. Alright, so this yeah. guy's like just chock full of my weapons. I hope he didn't like glitch into this wall in a way that I can't pick them up. Alright, cool, there we go. Okay, I don't know what I like. Shock mace. Kinda want that. But I like my Sauron mace. Hmm. I don't like that. Okay, well, so whatever, sure, okay. I need to sell shit. That's what needs to come. That's definitely what needs to happen here. Alright, what do oh, we Oh, wait, when here? you drop weapons, I can pick them up and sell them for fat monies. Cause they are worth way more than any weapon I find. Looks like I found a door. Found some stairs, Hardy. They lead down into some kind of crypt. How's the entrance? Is it accessible? Nah, damn thing completely flooded. Shit. All right, stay there. We're on our way down. Maybe Trevor can figure something out. Sure, I ain't got nothing better to do than stand around in the Baby dark. Black. There it goes. <laughs> 